Two men, each of them suspected of killing four people in Idaho, are making headlines tonight. Brian Kohlberger will be back in court later this week asking a judge to throw out his indictment. Kohlberger is accused of killing four University of Idaho students last November. He faces the death penalty if convicted. On Thursday, his attorneys will ask a judge to throw out the grand jury indictment used to charge him, pointing to what the defense says were errors in the grand jury instructions. In Shoshone County, quadruple murder suspect Major John Kaler wants evidence evidence against him thrown out. Kaler is accused of killing two teenage boys, their mom and their grandpa. Kaler lived next door to the family in Kellogg and thought one of the boys had exposed himself to Kaler's children. Court documents show Kaler admitted to killing them, but now says the officers did not read him his Miranda rights before questioning him. In his argument, Kaler says he was held at a church for hours near the crime scene and that, quote, he was surrounded by religious decor in a church, a place that traditionally insists that an individual confess his sins. He also described a chaotic crime scene and the fact he hadn't eaten, saying he made incriminating statements that should not be seen as voluntary. You can read more details on why Kaler wants those statements thrown out. It's a top story on KXLY.com.